So a lot of people think of groundwater depletion, they immediately think of the high plains, uh, or they may think of the Central Valley in California, but actually groundwater depletion is an issue that exists in various places around the country, uh, from the East Coast to the West. Um, and so the issues, the issues are uh, very um, locally dependent. Uh, so in some cases, for example, uh, you have the saltwater intrusion issue, which I mentioned before, we're pumping groundwater, too much groundwater too close to the sea or to a saline water body causes intrusion of that salt water into the water supply and you have to essentially usually abandon those wells and move somewhere else. Uh, other cases, you've lowered the water table so much that it's gotten very expensive to pump water. Um, in others, for example, in, the, in California, Central Valley, um, the problem of land subsidence exists, so if you pump too much groundwater and you get level, water levels down below levels that they've been at before, then you start to have the land subside, which can cause all kinds of problems with infrastructure on the land surface. And uh, In fact, the, uh, a major area of land subsidence historically in the United States is Houston, uh, which uh, had about 10 feet of subsidence in, in part of, of Houston and, and has actually exacerbated their vulnerability to to hurricanes, for example, the recent Hurricane Harvey, because of the lowering of the land surface right there next to the sea. Now they've brought that under, they've brought their land subsidence, they've taken large measures to try to bring that land subsidence under control, but they have the, of course, the subsidence they've had historically uh, can't be undone. Um, and in other areas, particularly in some of the, uh, well, really areas across the country from Wisconsin to Washington to Arizona, you have problems where groundwater pumping is reducing flows and streams, um, and it's competing essentially with the water that people either either people have uh, vested in surface water or fish, for example, salmon uh, is a big issue in the Pacific Northwest relative to groundwater pumping. So it's a big topic, and it, it manifests itself uh, in different ways across the United States.